Hello to everyone, the free tool you can use to upscale your images. For some period of time I used Nightmare tool and it was incredible. But eventually it became a paid tool, so I needed to find some another tool I can use for my images. So let's go and I will show you what tool I found. And this is ggb.lll tool and it's completely free. So let's go further. Here is some functions you can use with this website. So it can convert your AGB to SMIC. There is an upscaler that replaces Nightmare tool I used. There is AI background remover, Midjourney image splitter, image type converter, DPI enhancer and image to vector tool. So let's check for example the main idea and why I looked for this tool it's image upscaler. There is one type of advertisement you will see. This just some little commercial banners and that's all. So you don't need to pay for this tool, just see some uh, banners uh, with advertisement. So there is drag and drop, browse file. And there is one cool thing I want to show you. Choose the upscaling option. There is detailed, could be noisy, balanced, cartoon drawing and fine tuning. And this is a cool thing because now you can separate your images that you want to upscale. For example, for photos uh, they recommend uh, choose detailed version. For example, some images for a coloring book and something else, there is a cartoon drawing style. And let's take our image, let it be this doc, drag and drop, let's choose cartoon drawing and click upscale go to my files click here or here and there is our image approximately we need to wait one minute uh, we are uh, seventh in the queue and there is refresh button so just click here not on the uh, bar and just wait around one minute while we're waiting let's go to other tool there is image upscaler and there is a background remover. So as you understand, it's very easy. Uh, you just drag and drop your image with background that you want to remove. That's all. So let's check. Here's my strange pineapple. Let's take, for example, the second one, upscale it. Open the browser and take our pineapple. Drag and drop. You can change the intensity. Let it be for around 5 and click remove background. The same way it's uploaded to this website and go to the my files. Okay, let's click here. So there is our images that is already. We can download it and let's check it. Here is our image and it upscales 4 times. So let's compare it with our uh, non-upscaled image. So here is our original image. Increase the size. Okay, let it be like this, for example. So as you can see, this is upscaled four times images. And of course, if you want to upscale it more, just take this image, upscaled image, and drag and drop to this tool again. Let's refresh our background remover. Okay, it's ready. PNG. There is PNG file. So it... Okay, there is some glitches. Not the ideal tool, but I think they will improve for themselves. Don't forget, it's completely free tool. So let's go further. Home. The next tool we can use. Midjourney Image Splitter. As you can see, Midjourney image URL. And let's take our docs. Let it be there. Open in browser. Increase. And there is copy image address. Let's go back. And copy past our URL. Choose cartoon style. File type. Okay, let it be GPG. And the core cool thing. Now we can upscale, for example, first and second image only or all four images or only four and first image that's all now we just click submit processing and let's go to our files 
let's refresh it so as you can see now there is uh, two commands first our image and first our image in queue six and seven and just wait but i don't want to waste my time so let's go and check other tools let's go home so the next one is image type converter pretty understand you just uh, take your file and choose output type any you want JPEG, PNG, if TGA, I even don't understand what the type is. XBM, XPM, oh, picture, okay, it's picture, uh, PMA, P6, fits, DDS, come on. If you know these types of images, leave the comment below this video and explain what type is and uh, what for. Uh, image type converter okay uh, dpi enhancer you can use if you don't know what it is i want to explain you so i just google it dpi is for example ppi and dpi ppi it's a uh, pixel per inches and dpi dots per inches so e as you can see in one pixel there is could be a lot of dots so the more dots the better quality of image is for example this image uh, 30 dpi 60 dpi and 120 dpi so this image is definitely um, with more quality so with this tool you can increase your dpi for your images let's go back and the last one image to vector it's interesting tool well interesting if you use your images and then change it in photoshop or some any other tool this tool could be very useful for you so let's take a one hour image and uh, convert it to svg file so let it be our doc and convert to vector and let's go to our files there is our docs we uh, uploaded before our first and fourth doc we can download it as you remember we upscaled this image before we continue if you like this video give me a thumb button subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to see when i produce a new video let's go and create some other image and upscale it with uh, other definition. So here is our photo style image. Let's take, for example, this one, third, upscale it. Okay, now open browser. <laughs> okay, mid journey. There are three fingers, three. Oh my God, come on. Uh, save to downloads let's go home image upscaler take our image and choose let it be the first one detailed version upscale meanwhile you can queue another job yes i want it the same picture but let's choose cartoon drawing style and upscale now we need to wait a few moments later and first our image is ready let's download it and compare it with our not upscaled there is the original one. Oh, okay of course you can see the difference this is detailed version not the best but the, as you can see there is a lot of different pixels there is not and now let's check cartoon version cartoon version is ready open it and let's check this is detailed version this is cartoon version as you can see yeah it's pretty familiar with some vectorized style i think so more smoothly yeah more smoothly 
So now you understand what detail version is and what cartoon style is and now you can choose depending on the version you want to create. And before we finish this video, don't forget we vectorize our image. So let's go and check. Let's download it. SVG file and for example I will use Affinity Designer. There is our SVG file, SVG doc. And as you can see, there is a lot of different things we can change. For example, this eye. We can change the color, the out color, the nose. Just take it, delete it, delete this. Even this uh, creepy dog. <laughs> Change the color. This to this. Let it be something like this. Whatever you want. So with this tool, you will be able to make other things that you couldn't do with nightmare tool and now if you didn't see i highly recommend to see this video where i show you 23 unique styles that you can use for mid journey images so i really hope this video was helpful for you if you didn't give me a thumb button just do it right now and hope i will see you in the next video bye bye and wish you a good luck